Hey folks, Gwo here, and welcome back to another episode of Professor Layton and the Curious Village. <laughs> I'm just kidding. It's just because the music reminds me of uh, Professor Layton. Yeah, we're back with some more Tales of Fantasia, Toilet of Paper, and yeah, we found the bugbears again. All right, I got them this time. Meow, 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 meow. Oh, bugbears, meow. Even though they're called bears, shouldn't they roar? I don't know, they're just trying to make them cute, aren't they? Here it goes. Gonna use the soul wave on him. Soul wave! It's gonna hit him all. Oh man, it didn't even do that much damage. But I like how the soul wave, you know, it creates like a barrier between you guys. I don't know. It's pretty awesome. Pretty awesome, that's all I gotta say. Look at all the gold we're getting! Oh man, speaking of gold, if we look at our menu again, look at we're almost at 3 million gold. Just 2 million more and we can get that combo controller and do some Hadoukens. Hadouken! Yeah. Play some Street Fighter on my pad. Okay. I have a feeling we're almost there, cause... Oh great, I should use the Holy Bottle. Get out of here! Just trying to push that branch back, because as we all know... There we go, Mecha Blade is... Oh no, they're gonna use Explode! Oh, poor Chester's gonna die! Hey, so uh, I've been watching a lot of Avatar lately. Like, I'm already on Season 3. Yeah, and I think I'm almost finished. I think I'm on Episode 8 now. I just finished watching the Puppet Master episode with the weird old waterbender that teaches Katara how to, how to blood bend, which is kind of scary. Imagine if you could control people by controlling their blood. That, that's crazy, dude. Anyway, we've made it. Oh, we are awesome. I'm sure there's some magical presence here. It could be Origin. Here? When Rambard used the power of the stone to repair the rings here in the past, I knew I saw something. Now I'm positive what I saw was the spirit Origin. Huh? Arch! What? Ha <laughs> ha! Good old Arch sneaking in again. Ha <laughs> ha! I followed you. Up there? It's Arch. With Volt's power, she can soar above the trees for hours. Oh, what is that? This is no time to joke around. I see you arrive bearing both the Firebrand and the Vorpal. The Firebrand? But they call it a Flame Burge. Oh, anyway. Are you ready? Yes. Oh, crap, we have to fight? I wasn't ready for a boss fight. We're fighting Seraphim and Origin. Okay, I don't, I don't even think I equipped the right spells or anything like that, but... And then I'm gonna have to use a orange gum... I knew I should have probably... This pisses me off when I, like... I run into a boss battle and I'm not prepared for it at all. But, um, so far so good. I mean, it seems like we're... Yeah, look at that. Doing well. Eat the soul edge, buddy. Uh, sounds like Mega Man music. Yeah, eat it. All right, let's pin him. Let's pin him down. We got this guy, man. Let's go. We got this. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. You like that? Yeah. Uh, yeah. Yeah. Lemons. Yeah. Mega Man. <laughs> and just to make things extra special, mint. Can you use your Valkyrie on us, please? Thank you. Yeah! Oh no! There we go. Now we're gonna deal even more damage. Yeah! 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 Dude, this is the best boss fight ever! Yeah! Oh man, I love it. That was cake. And we got a question mark bow. Ten bucks says it's a short bow. Wouldn't that suck? Unbelievable! I actually lost out to a bunch of mortals! Well then, what can I do for you? I'd like two things. First, create the Eternal Sword from these two. We've collected both the fly- uh, They called it a Firebrand, now they're calling it a Flame Burge. So, um, yeah, those two swords. Second, I'd like a contract. And what do you need that for? We need it to bind Deus to this time in order to kill him. 
This? He's a toughie. Hehe. <laughs> What's so funny? The entire world is at stake. Oh please, you humans can be so self-important, and so narrow-minded. Why, I bet you haven't even thought about why Deus is here, have you? Or who he even is, or where he's from? His methods and reasonings are far beyond your comprehension. He's right, we don't know all there is to know about Deus, but there are many people who are suffering or dying by his hands. We're just trying to save our world. Regardless, you did defeat me in battle, so I am obligated to grant your wishes. Place the swords and the diamond ring on the stone and step aside. Oh, look at the two cool swords! Yeah! Yeah! So cool! What's happening? Oh, well, there goes the diamond ring. I mean, yeah, so much for that. Oh, he broke him. Oh, no. What's happening? Da -na -na -na. You got the Master Sword! This is the Eternal Sword? Yeah, we got it! We got it at Ross. We got it. Something is speaking to me. Wield this sword with honesty and justice. I feel a new ability within me, like you always feel. Teleport, Soul Strike, and Soul Forge. Oh man, like, I think we're pretty legit. Now it's my turn! Yes, I suppose. Spirits of magic, I beseech you, grant me the power of creation. My name is Clarth. Well now, don't we feel super buff? But see, now Origin is kind of making me wonder what the hell's going on in this game. I mean, could Deus actually be a good person? Anyway, we have gained the ability to summon the King of Dwarves, Origin. Now all we need to do is find out where Deus is hiding. But we don't even know where to begin to look. Maybe Runeglom can help us out. I agree with Arch. Let's go to Alvanista. Story time, story time. Ah, you've done it! Yes, where should we look for Deus? I'm not entirely sure. What do you mean? Well, I have a theory. There's a place at the southern end of the world that is always covered in darkness. Oh yeah, we've been there. There's a town there called... Eri. 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 <laughs> Ask the people of that town for more information. Do you think Deus caused the darkness? It's possible that the darkness is required for him to keep his hideout invisible. Hmm... I'm sorry, I can't offer you any concrete evidence. Well, I guess we be off for... we'll be off for Aerie then. Good luck, please be careful. Peace out, Runeglom. Alright, well, let's check out this new sword. That'd be funny if we went into, like, battle and we didn't have a weapon equip. But dude, this is the coolest sword in the world, a sword that embodies all the mysteries of time and space. Super weapon! We should challenge the Colosseum now. <laughs> Alright, but formation, please, can we change? Ch Chester, get out of here. Arch, you, you need to be back at the party. <laughs> Let's see. Hmm. I don't think we'll need these nymph rings anymore, right? Should we... Yeah, man. I'm trying to think. What was it? The fairy ring? Where's the fairy ring at? Come on, fairy ring. There you are. Wait, I just. I just saw it. Where did it go? God, I wish there was a way to just. There it is. I don't know. If they could sort these out, I mean, that'd be so much easier. Okay, Nymph Ring. You know what, we'll give you the Diamond Ring for now, since we're not going to be in heat anymore. Wow, we have three Fairy Rings, that is so cool. But yeah, we're going to give that to you, Clarth. Sh uh, yeah, so you're shielded from all types of magic. Okay, now let's see. 
Where should we go now? Hey! How come I can't run anymore? Oh, I didn't want to... No, Mint, come back in the party. What did I equip Chester with? Okay. Chester has the jet boots equipped. Okay, formation, change. Why can't I run anymore? This is stupid. Yeah. I'm a soldier visiting from Euclid. I'm here to give the proper titles to local swordsmen. No, I don't want to be called a fighter. No, I don't want to be called a knight. You can call me an expert. I'm cool with that. But I kind of like master. Alright, but it looks like we have to equip one of the active party members with... I don't know what happened. I mean, it was working in that town, but now... I don't know, it's dumb. I don't understand this. Okay. Well, anyway... Let's get those jet boots back on. Kind of a bummer. Okay, now where are we off to? Do 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 do. Oh yeah, it should be side quest time. If I could figure out how to get out of here first. Oh, there it is, down there. Okay, so side quest time. Um, I'm gonna go back to the the caves where the sylphs are. Um, yeah, the sylph cave. Uh, man, all those places. But first and foremost. Let's try racing this kid again. Yeah, let's race this kid. We've, we're entering the 128th annual Alvinista Marathon. Why not enter and win a prize? How about it? Sure. Need an explanation? No. Let's get started. Okay, let's see if I, I still got this. Two, one, go. Oh crap, I took too wide of a turn. Damn it, this kid's fast. You're too slow. Oh wow, and he doesn't slow down where the where the other kid used to slow down, so. Okay, I got this. I got this kid beat. Okay, let's keep going. Oh no! Crap, he's gonna... He's gonna get me right here. Damn it. Damn it, damn it, damn it, damn it, damn it. Damn it, damn it, damn it, damn it. Damn it. Damn it. Ah, oh, crap. Ah, oh, you jerk. Really? Really? You're gonna call me a slowpoke? Yeah, I'll beat you this time. Oh no, I didn't want an explanation! No. Okay, here, I, I got him this time. Two, one, go! God. <laughs> Whoops. Three, two, one. Alright. It's okay, I got him this time. Damn it. So if you're ahead of him... If you're ahead of him, he won't slow down. But if you're losing to him, looks like he slows down. Okay, let's let's go. The, let's go. No, no text messages right now. You're gonna throw me off from my race. Get out of my way, stupid kid. Okay, we got this. We got this in the bag. Oh no, stupid kids. No, no, no. Let's go. Let's go. Let's go. 
Yeah, sucker! I won. Now I can choose a prize. What do I want? An S flag, a silver matic, or a bow or a bow? I want an S flag, whatever the heck that is. Come back for a rematch. Hey, we did it, people! How about that? Now let's see what an S flag does. Huh, a trading good. A flag with a large S painted on it. Oh, that's freaking obvious. Oh wait, since we're here, we should probably use our rune bottles too. There we go. Let's go identify stuff. Like this new bow that we found. What is it? It is a soul stealer. That drains the user's life to deliver extra damage. Wow, that sounds intense. Okay. Hmm, kind of want to do one more race for that silver matic. Uh, let's do it. Do we need an explanation? No. Okay, we got the kid beat this time. Maybe it's like some cool piece of armor. Probably not. Since we're already pretty... Oh crap, I already messed up. <laughs> I was getting ahead of myself. Well, this is a... See, look at He actually slows down if you're losing him right there. But once you start winning, he doesn't slow down, which is... It's okay. I got this kid. There we go. Wow! How did I overtake him right there? That's so crazy. But now it's going to be hard to get some space between... Oh, shoot! God! Oh, really? Wait, can we, like... Yeah, let's... We're going to have to give this one up. Okay, go in there, come back out. It's, it's kind of a bummer. Yes, I want to join. No, I don't need an explanation. Let's get started. It's just because I messed up right from the start. That's the only reason. I should I had that one. So yeah, you don't have to go out wide on that first turn, but here you do. Okay. Yeah, let's go. Crap. Oh my way, stupid kid. Okay. There we go. Go out wide. Go out wide. Alright. Doing this. Doing this. Doing this. Doing it. Doing it. For the win. Oh no. Okay. Okay. Don't get sloppy. Don't get sloppy. You can do this. All right, a little faster, a little faster. There we go. We got this. Got this one. Sucker! What up? What up? Yeah, I won. Now I get to choose a prize. I want the silver matic, whatever that is. Come back for a rematch. Okay. I wonder what that does now. Wow. Renders the wearer immune to many common magic spells. That is kind of cool. I need to do some research to see what that actually keeps you immune to, but I mean, that sounds really legit. Um, yeah, okay. Now, I remember this girl saying she always, they give uh, prizes to the fastest person in town. That's me, give me prizes. Okay. So before we end this episode off and start our side quest, we are going to buy some more rune bottles, because yeah, we need rune bottles. And holly bottles. And dark bottles. Hmm. Now, where are those rune... There they are. I'll just buy that many. Alright. And hey! We're rich. Alright, people, so thanks for watching, and like I said in our next episode, we are going to go hunting for some summon rings. So take it easy, everybody. See you next time. Jiwo out.